but it just took two brains, two minds and just one collaboration. That's the reason why we are standing over here today. And sincere thanks to the two brains behind this entire project, Dr. Vyaman and Dr. Vyas from CFMID. It's a matter of great pleasure for me to stand over here and be blessed enough to be speaking to you all. Thank you very much to each one of you to be present over here. Why uh, it just took two brains to envisage? One of the points I would like to mention that we can do as an organization and contribute to the nation. Uh, in terms of helping people understand their area of in one potential. So that's been one of our, yes, as an organization, profit making, making is one of the objective. But at the same time, our whole objective, if you look at the pricing at which we operate in the market, we do at one tenth of the cost of the current prices which are there. And the objective is, how is it that we can contribute towards nation building? That has been our objective. The strength behind Center for Multiple Intelligence and Dermatoglyphics Limited has been the team of effective consultants who are the backbone of this entire work that we are trying to do. In the last 11 years, we have undertaken different kind of training programs. We have done certified dermatoglyphics consultant training program. The reason being, as you very rightly said, sir, this is one of the most unorganized segment in which we were trying to work, to be very honest with you. I don't want to hold any words because we have been speaking what is coming to my mind on this front. So our effort was to try and bring in some kind of sanctity into this field of where we are operating, dermatoglyphics and in one potential assessment and how is it that we can try and bring in some structure with this vision. Uh, Mr. Marcus Ling, who is the co-founder of CFMID based out of Malaysia, uh, he started his first training program in India. We were the first company in India to come out with a training program and try to work towards spreading out the right kind of message. As you rightly said, there are people who do prediction. But our way of looking at things is like, how is it that we can try and make life easier for a parent in terms of helping them understand the child, helping them understand how is it that they need not run the rat race. How is it that they can try and specifically focus and help a child nurture in their area? That is our first objective. Then came uh, in 2017 when we thought a child is also spending a good amount of time with a teacher. So how is it that we can try and bring in the education system into this work of developing the inborn potential of the child? And that is where uh, we introduced world's first classroom seating management the tool called as Classograph, which we are currently under provisional training. So the whole effort of Classograph is, how is it that it can simplify lives of teachers? How is it that it can help them understand that there is a rat race which is going on and hey child, you are different in many ways. And how is it that you can work towards bringing out that difference in you and shine in your India? So yes, there are people who do prediction, there are a lot of unorganized segments in this area which is working and our effort as an organization. We are the only limited company in the field of dermatoglyphics uh, based in one potential assessment. But otherwise there are a lot of free elements. Pirated software is one of our biggest issues like it was very uh, 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 conveyed by Dr. Wireman. Pirated software is one of the biggest issues which is based by this industry. So somebody who has a software who understands how to read English goes and delivers. So this is our biggest challenge. The reason why we started approaching the university and the reason why uh, we thought of having this collaboration is only to bring in sanctity into this segment because we have been working in this. There is a team which has been working in this. Our consultants who have been doing effective. Even if a child has scored 95% in 10th grade and looking at the report, the report suggests that this child is not cut out for science maybe but the child can do very well in art segment and the child does that the student gets into enrollment into the art fraternity and after three or four years comes out with flourishing result so as an organization our mission is how is it that we can contribute to nation building by working towards developing the happiness quotient of each and every stakeholder right from our customers uh, who can work towards this so this has been our work and the reason why we introduced training was just to develop the right kind of talent pool who can learn this subject and impact life. 
So that was the whole objective with which we started. As an organization, while we were growing, while we were uh, 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 growing in the sense, uh, when we started doing this training program, then there's a team which started getting formed out, when people started enrolling to this particular training program from different countries. Uh, for us, there was one person who was a very big motivator for our organization, and none other than Honorable Prime Minister of India. And the way the central government schemes came out, started rolling out, it was as if, for us, we got a feeling as if it's a blessing for us. Like one of the schemes which make in India. So for, for us, if you look at dermatoclinics as a segment, before 2015, many people were saying that this report is coming from this country, we bring report from this country. For us, we did everything in-house in Baroda. So one of the company which we say that, yes, we do make in India. So that is one of our very strong point and we say that nothing comes from outside and we don't want to do that so fast. We have everything made in India and that is where we want to show that we are a made in India company. So that is one thing. Then the second element is Atmanilbar Bharat. When COVID came in, so uh, 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 the application, we made our consultants Atmanilbar. They did not stop work just by doing a little bit of uh, Zoom or Google Meet and it, that is used for consultation platform and through the application we collect fingerprint today sitting in any corner of the, any corner of the world a customer can submit the fingerprint everything is processed in Baroda they can submit it through this particular application which is the unique app then came the wonderful scheme of local for vocal so our whole effort has been what is it that we can do within the within our local community and work towards developing the local community and that is where uh, our whole effort of having a base in Gujarat and all this tie up and everything is a part of our local for local particular and then local for global that is another objective because sitting over here today we can cover to the global markets and we can cater to so because earlier not only global market why global market even earlier a counsellor sitting in Chennai would find it very difficult to get a fingerprint from Kanjipuram but today that is made possible. We are able to get into inroads into rural India and at the same time sitting over here in Baroda, we can cater to the globe. So these are the uh, specific motivating factors for us which is currently keeping us going alive and peaking. And with this, I would like to give a sincere thanks to the university because, because of uh, the consultant, because of the team that is backing us, today we as an organization are found worth enough to come and stand over here and make ourselves uh, presentable to you and help you understand what we are working towards. So with this, I would like to thank you, thank you everyone for giving us an opportunity and sincere thanks from my side for all of you to listen. Thank you very much. Thank you.